As consumer demand grows for renewable products, North Dakota is stepping up its response. A new soybean crushing facility is coming to the state. The $350 million facility will be able to process up to 150,000 bushels of soybeans per day. The, uh, the company building it is called ADM. Leaders said North Dakota will be responsible for making more value added products like renewable diesel. North Dakota Senator John Hoven calls it a win for the state. There's a lot of small businesses that it takes to keep this plant going. So big economic activity, a real win for our farmers because they can bring their crop right to the plant, reduce their transportation costs. So a huge ag win. The plant is expected to create 70 jobs and open in spirit wood by the 2023 harvest. As dry weather continues, the National Sunflower Association is seeing good things for sunflowers. Prices are at their highest level in nine years, and acreage is expected to increase as more farmers switch to the more drought-resistant crop. Sunflowers have a deep tap root, which so uh, as long as uh, there's enough moisture to get started, they can reach down deeper than other plants. Sunflower planting is underway in North Dakota. Up next in sports, something new is coming to Davies High School. What role it'll play for many of their athletes.